Marcus uh, drew one of the more uh, uh, fantastic subjects, which I think is uh, good for you because you're, you're an incredibly eccentric person. And we had a great day today, Jason and I running around. And when we met you today, let us know what, 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 what your thought process was of what, what was going on. Um, I, I was uh, trying to figure out uh, for a while what I was actually going to do, and I, I didn't really uh, figure out through the night. And in the morning, I woke up early. I didn't go to bed until about two o'clock. And then in the morning, I woke up like eight o'clock in the morning. And I still was like, God, what was going to do? I was going to do like a few other like more conceptual numbers, um, but then I uh, kind of steered away from it. And then uh, I just uh, finally got out of my house about ten o'clock and just ran down to Chinatown and just started picking up like the most funkiest, nastiest uh, shit I can find. Um, and then um, I came back here and I was still, I kind of had a vision, but I still wasn't uh, so dedicated to that vision. And then as soon as I um, started getting through the first shot, when you guys, when I met up with you guys, I was in the, the tanglement of the first shot, which I wasn't really uh, so happy with. Oh, it was your first shot? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, could had... you repeat the entire thing without using the word shit? Oh, are you serious? I'm, I'm kidding. <laughs> oh, I don't like, oh. really care. <laughs> like, <laughs> no. Let's go from the beginning. <laughs> So let me say, I was woke up this morning. No, um, yeah, and then that was when the pig foot. I had the pig foot out on the table, and uh, I was using crazy amounts of light. Uh, my f-stop was like 32. I had bellow compensation, a big old uh, step-up ring, a 65 millimeter lens. So I was shooting with a lot of light. Um, but the the rings that I was using actually, w it wasn't really jiving with what I was thinking. It was a little too uh, too detailed and too close up. So I kind of had to rethink a lot of stuff. Um, and originally, I was going to kind of build, kind of make up, kind of like. You know, if you're uh, from a, a parallel universe and you were gonna make a sandwich, but you didn't know what to put in it, and it was like would be like a you know a hamburger bun with like a you know a chicken claw in it, and then sauce it up and you know put like miscellaneous things on it. So right. it would still be kind of like a, a sandwich, or it'd be like a hamburger or or a hot dog, but it would be made out of really miscellaneous in, ingredients that people do eat. Um, but it wouldn't be something that you would necessarily be accustomed to eating. Right. Um, but then I, it is the more I started messing with it, the more I realized I just don't, I'm not like chef out or food style stout. So right. I kind of had to that revert was funny back to the composition. As we saw each other, I said, wow, you, but you're being very interstellar. Like, yeah, uh, yeah. yeah I, was, cool. I was trying to in, in tune with the cosmos, I suppose. But, uh, uh, but I, 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 I did see one JPEG, a flash JPEG of something that looked like what was... Uh, a delightful, um, delightfully delicious nightmare. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I don't know what, like, what you call it. Seriously. But it, it was, yeah, yeah, and it was funny because out of all the all the ingredients that I got from like dried minnows to like dried squids, like um, you know seahorses, all these like little uh, quail eggs, all these things kind of came together. And aesthetically, when I was looking for them, I wasn't necessarily trying to find the most disgusting thing because there were obviously more disgusting things than that. But they kind of all fit together in this weird kind of like you know, color scheme and, and what they actually were. So by the end of the end of the shot, I put them all together. Yeah. And then you get this gorish kind of nightmare thing of things that you could possibly eat. I wouldn't eat them, but people do eat these things. And that's, it's kind that's of, awesome. yeah, it's pretty interesting. Way to go. I think you did a great job. And, um, uh, uh, we, we love working with you. It was the first time that, that here at Dare Magazine, we've worked with you. So yeah. Yeah. It was a great experience. Yeah, Thanks for in the including future, me. Totally. Like, totally into uh, your photography and what you do. And Definitely. Stuff. Thanks. All Cheers. Right. All right. Awesome. Yeah.